Welcome back to Squawk Box. CNN has fired three employees who came to work without getting a COVID vaccine. In an email to employees, CNN President Jeff Zucker saying those employees violated the company's honor system, which had asked workers to attest that they were vaccinated, but didn't require them to produce evidence. Zucker said there is a zero tolerance policy. Those who come to the office or work in the field with other employees need to be vaccinated. Up to now, workers had been coming into the office on a voluntary basis. The company was targeting September 7th as its official return, like so many other businesses, to, it off, to the office. But Zucker said that date has now been postponed. But, Becky, I, I think this is one of those moments. There's been a big question within the business world, not just should you, should, should you require vaccines, but then how are you going to enforce it? What are you going to do? Is there going to be a... Uh, a grace period. What's going to happen? Jeff Zucker effectively saying this matters and it's serious. Yeah, I, look, there's a lot of questions. Uh, and I think we've kind of all seen through the pandemic that there are rules that are put in place and there are places where they are very strictly followed and places where they are not. Um, some places weren't very on, to on top of things in terms of making sure they were following the mandates that were kind of put out there. And, and we've all seen and heard about places where that's happened. Clearly not the case here. My guess is there'll be some pushback, at least from some places in CNN, just because it was voluntary to show up at work. Um, maybe there were people who thought this was another place where things were lax. You know, Jeff Zucker saying, no, 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 this is very clear. You can't show up without that. And... I think we'll probably start to see more and more places that are going to require vaccines, particularly as the emergency use authorization uh, is, is moved to full authorization. That's going to happen right. very quickly with Pfizer and probably Moderna, too. And that may um, alleviate some of the legal issues that employers had considered before. Always an interesting question, by the way, how key the employees are. Because yeah. when you think about it, um, I don't know. If it had been, um, you know, a, a uh, you know, a primetime star anchor, for example, would, would if he come to that same conclusion? We don't know who these three employees are. I'm, I'm not saying they're important or unimportant, but I have to imagine that actually must weigh in the decision, you would think. Not, not, maybe, maybe, maybe it shouldn't. Not. I mean, look, if he's, maybe if it he's setting, if he's laying down the law and setting rules, it shouldn't yep. um, matter. No, it who shouldn't. It was. I'm, just, I'm just saying in the, in the, in the practical universe, if you got into a situation like that as a boss, where you'd actually have to, if, 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 your, if your great rainmaker was this person, w you know, what would you decide to do? I don't know. And I, that's, I will by the say way, that I, this sends a very clear message um, for, oh, very for much what the so. policy is going to be from are, here on out. There are a number of business leaders that I've heard from, as I've been talking a lot about vaccine mandates, who've said, look, you know, we could, we could say that we're going to do it, but then how are we going to enforce it? What are we really going to do? You know, maybe, maybe Jeff Zucker is the model then. I don't know. I don't know. It's it's we're, we're, we're in uncharted models. territory. Yeah, there's there yep. there will be lots of models and there are um, pretty different feelings in different parts of the country um, and, and in different businesses, too. So I, I think there's probably going to be lots of models going forward. But this is a pretty clear one that says, yeah, zero tolerance policy. And here's the proof of that. So I don't think anybody will have any questions at CNN from here on out. You think there's a lawsuit? Um, I don't know. <laughs> it seems like you can get a lawsuit for just about anything. So, um, well, that's true. That's true. <laughs> the question is whether there's a winning lawsuit. Right. So, right. 